There are a few things I want to talk about. This game's dying. The reason this game, I believe, is dying is for a few reasons. One, the freaking mech. I think they need to get rid of the mech. I mean, it just doesn't make any sense to me. Someone who could have just started the game today can hop in this mech and while I'm 90 in the air like a freaking god, can just shoot me and rocket me to death. When it first came out, dude, this thing was OP. It had 1,000 rockets, it had 1,000 health. I mean, it was, it was crazy. It was crazy OP. So then they decided to... Crap. I mean, listen to this. Like, what in the... I mean, it's just full of people spamming at this point. Like, there's now the the silence SMG. There's the TAC SMG. I've heard rumors of them bringing back the regular SMG or the non-silenced one. Whatever they're all called. I mean, there's so many. So there's so many of them. It's just like no matter how much you try and box up or protect yourself, there's nothing you can do. There's a mech shooting a million rockets at you. A default with an SMG that just keeps spamming you. <laughs> Like, there's nothing you can do. I feel like they're trying to make it fair for everybody when, in reality, they should just make it fair in general. If one person's struggling, don't add something to make that person better. They need to get better. They need to work at it themselves, and they need to get better. Why is it that they can pick up an SMG and kill a person who's been playing this game since Season 2? It doesn't make any sense. So, yeah, I mean, I think this game could be way better off without the attack SMG and without the mech, especially the mech. I hate the mech, dude. Please. Get rid of the mech! But, yeah, I mean, the amount of times that I've died because I'm just, you know, I'm boxing up, I'm trying to heal or I'm trying to get away from fights and instead of building or you know counteracting people these kids are just grabbing SMGs and spamming through every single wall and the fact that you can get a legendary one from freaking Starry now doesn't make it any better I heard they're gonna do some big revamp with the map uh, at the end of the season which is in like what seven days or something and apparently they're gonna wipe out the entire map and I think they should I mean I love this game I think it's like it's as balanced as it can get but there, there's obvious things that they won't fix This kid actually hit the headshot. Incoming! Incoming! Ow. Come on, one tap. Pop! See, this is why I hate the game. Because of that. That. Right there. You see that? Boom. Right there. That's why I hate the game. No, I'm just kidding. I just died. That was a pretty nice headshot on his part. But I have had a lot of instances of these thing. Cue the montage. All the way. What? As you can see, desync is a close friend of mine. But for you to really understand what I'm trying to tell you about desync, I'm gonna take you back. I'm gonna take you back about four years ago to a game I used to play before Fortnite even existed called H1Z1. Now, H1Z1 was like the first battle royale. They had a really good system. There was no building involved. There was just a few guns, a few different guns you could use. You would run around in open terrain. You can get cars. You'd shoot people. Last one standing wins. It was basic. All the popular Fortnite streamers you know today, like Ninja, Tifu, a couple other guys, all those guys used to play H1Z1. That was their go-to game. That was what they played before Fortnite blew up. Now, H1 was a really popular game at the time. See, H1 thought it would be a good idea to change their game in a sense and what i mean by this is they had a good game going this was in season three of h1z1 it was a good game they had people playing it but they had a lot of glitches for example cars you would get in would randomly explode you could fall through the map different things like that would result in people getting very mad now there was a simple fix to this they fixed the glitch that was it right that's all you do wrong they decided to change spray patterns, sounds, guns, take away guns, add new guns. And this ultimately led to the demise of H1Z1. And that's where I fear Fortnite is going with their game. They've gotten up there. They've been the biggest game for a while now. And I'm afraid they're going to overdo it at some point. Whether or not you believe this is up for interpretation. But that's just my theory on Fortnite so far. I feel that they're going to take it to a point where people are going to get so pissed that... They're not going to want to play the game anymore. Anyways, thanks guys for watching. If you think that I was correct and you feel that this is going to happen for the future of Fortnite, like my comment. If you don't, let me know why in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe. And thank you guys very much. I will see you guys later.